Welcome to this part of the UM30-2 tutorial series. In this section we will show you the limit switching point. For this we will use an actual setup. A UM30-2 is horizontally clamped in a flexible arm. We have connected a sensor demonstration box between the power supply and the UM30-2. The setup is powered up. The measurement distance of the UM30-2 is within the working range of 200 to 1300 mm. Position any ultrasonic reflecting object, such as a business card, in front of the sensor at the desired distance for the limit switching point. Then press the T2 key until D appears in the display. The sensor is then showing the current measurement value. Press and hold T2 until END appears in the display. And now the limit switching point is saved. Now you are below the switching point. And now you are above the switching point. The parameterization of the switching point is not only possible via t -chain, it can also be parameterized manually. Before we show you how to do the parameterization manually, please reset the UM30-2. Now keep T1 and T2 pressed down approximately 3 seconds until Hello has been displayed. When D appears, simultaneously press T1 and T2. Set the switching point in millimeters or centimeters. For down, press T1, and for up, press T2. Now simultaneously press T1 and T2. Three dashes appears on the display. For a simple switching point, simultaneously press T1 and T2. Select the normally closed, normally open contact. Simultaneously press T1 and T2 until END appears. To finish this parameterization, simultaneously press T1 and T2. The switching point is now saved. Now you are below the switching point. And now you are above the switching point. This tutorial series showed a demonstration of the UM30-2 without the use of a PC. Thank you for watching.